Hello, everyone. It may seem obvious to you that working on electrical circuits, especially energized ones, require the use of personal protective equipment. One of these is the electrical safety rubber gloves and its leather protectors. But I have seen people wearing only ordinary work gloves while taking electrical measurements on Category 3 and sometimes Category 4 locations. I am not here to judge them, nor do I endorse this practice. But I am curious, is there any insulation resistance at all on these leather work gloves? I know it isn't safe to use leathers alone, but by how much of insulation resistance does it differ, does it differ from a rubber glove? In this experiment, I will use my Hiyoki IR4057-20 insulation and resistance tester to find out. Please note that this is a DIY test and not a substitute for a proper laboratory test. This is simply my own way of finding the answer to the question above. First, I will test the insulation resistance of a certified electrical safety rubber gloves for reference. The testing voltage will be 500 volts DC and the maximum re insulation resistance at 500 volts DC for my, of, of my instrument is 2000 mega ohms. I expect the uh, rubber gloves to hit this level. This is a pair of uh, leather gloves for general work. These are leather gloves whose purpose is to protect the electrical safety rubber gloves. This is another pair of uh, rubber glove uh, leather protectors. Now these are a pair of my motorcycle riding gloves. While they are great for riding, I doubt if anyone will be wearing this for electrical work. But the reason I include this in the test is the special material at the tips of the fingers, which were supposed to allow the wearer to uh, effectively touch the screen of a cell phone. There may be work gloves out there with similar material and purpose. Let's see what the insulation resistance is on this 
spot here. And that settles it. This kind of material offers no insulation resistance at all. And if you're wearing leather work gloves and it happened to have a material like this one to, that allows you to uh, use your cell phone and uh, you use that gloves on electrical work, then you are putting yourselves in grave danger. I hope I have provided you with some insights on the importance of using electrical safety rubber gloves. As you have seen, the leather work gloves, including leather protectors alone, do not uh, provide the same level of insulation resistance and safety as the electrical safety rubber gloves. It is particularly even more dangerous if the gloves have some uh, conductive material on them, like the ones used to touch a cell phone screen. But rubber rubber gloves do need protection too and this is where the leather protectors come in. We wear the leather protectors over the rubber gloves to protect against abrasions, cuts and uh, perforations. Thank you for watching. Stay safe.